According to the World Wildlife Fund WWF, cotton is the most widespread non-food crop in the world. Its production employs almost 7% of all labor in developing countries, with around half of all textiles being made from cotton. Yet, while the global reach of cotton is wide, current cotton production methods are environmentally unsustainable, involving high water use and contamination, soil degradation, and pesticide pollution. To solve these issues, Natera has developed a pioneering method for growing cotton in climate-controlled greenhouse environments. Its method can produce up to four times more yield per surface area compared to conventional outdoor cotton farming. It also uses around 80% less water, no pesticides, and produces around 30% less carbon dioxide than chemically intensive cotton farming. Matera's approach is designed to future-proof the cotton industry, which around 250 million people rely on for income. By using resources more efficiently, Matera's system also acts as a form of climate change mitigation, transforming brownfield land into productive agricultural land. By using land more effectively, the company will be able to join forces with other impactful schemes that support biodiversity and carbon sequestration. Matera also highlights that one big advantage of their system is its flexibility, and ability to adjust the different parameters to produce the best outcome. The fashion industry is one of the most wasteful on the planet. Every aspect of the fashion supply and consumption chain produces huge amounts of waste, 87% of the materials and fibers used to make clothing will end up in either incinerators or landfills. Luckily, innovators the world over are now working to change this. You can contact them through website, matera.tech, contact, matera.tech slash contact us.